Hello, my name is Professor Rory Ridley Duff and in this video I'm going to show you how you can use the Social Enterprise Values Survey. This is a tool that it would enable you to find out what social enterprise preferences your members have and the implications this may have for organising your social enterprise. To use the social enterprise audit tool, you navigate to fairshares.coop forward slash social enterprise survey in your browser toolbar. On the page that opens, select take the survey. After inputting my name and accepting the Creative Commons license, I click next to see the usage options. I'm going to choose trial, which is good for teaching purposes as it bypasses the pages that collect biographical information. The first thing I see is a page about theoretical perspectives on social enterprise, which is used to structure the survey. This is actually taken from the textbook Understanding Social Enterprise Theory and Practice that I've written with Mike Bull. We offer three views of social enterprise. The first is undertaking charitable trading activities. The second is creating cooperative and mutual enterprises. Lastly, we define socially responsible businesses, those that have social or environmental purposes as their reason for being. The survey asks you about the characteristics of each of those approaches to social enterprise and asks you about your own experience of these characteristics and then allows you to exercise your own judgment based on your own experience of observing these characteristics in social enterprises that you've encountered. Let me fill out the first page. I'm just going to choose a random set of answers, so do not mistake these for my actual views. You will need to do this yourself and consider if the characteristic is something that you have seen in none, some, most or all social enterprises. Choose one option from every row. After the block of characteristics, read them again and assess them. How important are these characteristics to you? Next, you have a series of questions about the characteristics of cooperative mutual enterprises. Again, you say which of these characteristics you have observed in your interactions with enterprises in the social economy. And again, I will put in a series of random answers, not my real choices. Again, reread the characteristics and decide how important they are to you. Then lastly, there's a series of characteristics associated with socially responsible businesses. As with the previous sets of characteristics, reflect on whether these are things you have observed in your encounters with social enterprise and then assess how important they are to you. Finally, there's a space for reflection and learning. Having looked through the characteristics of three approaches to social enterprise, which set of characteristics appeal the most to you? For me, it would be cooperative mutual enterprises. You will see that there's a space to write a justification for your choice. Here is my justification for choosing CMEs as my own preference. If you think of using this survey in a work or consultancy context, you could use it to uncover your members' attitudes to different social enterprise attributes and characteristics and use the answers to stimulate a debate that benefits your social auditing efforts. If you're using this in an education setting, ask students to bring their responses to class so they can debate and discuss their preferences with other students. Either way, once you finish the survey, click Submit and the results will be emailed to you. All of our Fair Shares social auditing tools and diagnostics are available on the Fair Shares Association website. That's OK if you want to try them out and perhaps use them with students in a classroom setting. But if you want to do social auditing in a single organisation or in consultancy work, you'll need your own set of personal survey tools that you can customise. We provide these to members and people who have an annual subscription to the Fair Shares Association. 
If you go to fairshares.coop forward slash membership, you can apply for a subscription or for membership, and then we can provide you with your own set of tools. Audio Jungle. Audio Jungle. I hope you found that video useful. Uh, we have courses available on the website of the Fair Shares Institute. If you want to study to become a certified practitioner in Fair Shares, point your browser at fsi.coop forward slash courses to find out more information.